Welcome to Silicon Valley Asian Business Talk. So Dr. Conwell Ricky, and uh, welcome, and thank you for coming to talk to us. We really appreciate you spending time with us. Yeah, thank you for inviting me, and it's my pleasure. So Dr. Ricky, why don't you kind of briefly introduce yourself to our audience? Okay. Uh, yeah, so I'm Conwell Ricky. Yeah, I've been here in the Valley since 1971. Hardcore engineer by training, IIT Bombay, and became an entrepreneur in 1982. Yeah, at the dawn of the PC revolution, networking revolution, yeah, we pioneered the computer networking. Yeah, our company was a pioneer in the computer networking, and so we drew you know, with with the networking. We were the side of the foundational technologies for the internet and went public in 1987, first Indian American to take company public in 87. And uh, our company was eventually acquired by Novell, so I was at Novell you know, for about five years, six years, and, uh, and, and yeah, retired in 1995, early mm -hmm. on, and became active in the startup ecosystem, mentoring entrepreneurs, help start tie, and uh, you know, you know, interest you know, Indian Americans to become entrepreneurs rather than, than you know, you know, uh, job seekers. And I've been doing that now for 25, 27 years. Discussion topic, a unique model to invest in first time entrepreneurs. You know, it's a very interesting that relating to this because I know one of your company, which is kind of a in investor syndicated a company only focus on like a first time founder. Yeah. So uh, actually I'm curious um, because that kind of is very relevant to many yeah. young students. Yeah. So yeah. what's your yeah, so, so kind of an indicator to select uh, to invest? So, so we, we became a little bit mathematical. Become ma Math mathematical. Mathematical in our approach. Hmm. So you're playing the high risk game so you need to have a large portfolio. Mm. So, so this uh, Silicon Valley Quad formula is, A, we will do 32 companies. 32 companies, yeah, for example. Yeah, over mm. four years. Mm. Yeah. And so, you know, we, we are going to screw up. Yeah, they are super high risk. Yeah, we don't uh, miss more of them. And then we have a 31 investors in our syndicate. Mm. Yeah, so the capital is coming from 31 people, you know, 32 companies, and we are the sort of you know, a central point. So, so no one failure will sink us, and no one investor you know, you know, between unhappy will sink us. So we have to deal with everybody. That, a, we are trying to build this portfolio of 32 risky companies. Hopefully we are smart enough to get maybe one in four right. Yeah. And the way we have done is that uh, we initial valuation will reflect the risk we are taking. Mm. Yeah, I don't want to you know, value the company to the point you know where I want to make forty times my money on my winners. Mm. Yeah, if I you know, value them very highly, very unlikely to make forty times on my winners. So the goal is that. I want to be able to have one in four winner, mm. and I want to make 40 times on my winners. And yeah, so hopefully on, on the whole, we'll make 10 times our money. Yeah, and it's, it's very mathematically yeah, structured. And uh, if entrepreneur wants too much valuation, not interested. Okay, so that is from more financial perspective. No, no, right? yeah, but also now, Having 32 companies, we are going to go into 32 different situations. Mm. Oh, that's interesting. Also, yeah. diversify in terms of situation. What yeah. do you mean situations here? Yeah, yeah. So, so we are going to do some you know, SaaS companies. We are going to do some consumer companies. Oh. Yeah. We are, we are going to do. Yeah. You know, uh, uh, we we don't want to pile up on a given market, a given technology. Okay, 
So in other words, you diversify, reduce risk also by different uh, industries or sectors. Sectors and technologies. And uh, so, so it, it's a, uh, this came from my personal experience. You know, we don't know what the real answer is. It's all numbers today. It's all you know, statistics. Can I structure a situation where our brains are being used to pick the entrepreneurs and mentor the entrepreneurs and help them? Mm. Yeah, but but I, I'm not a magician. It's not a one, I cannot pick an entrepreneur and give him money and make it work. Yeah. So, so this has, you know, the number 32 was picked, you know, for that reason. And, and we, there's a time diversification also. We are going to do eight companies a year for four years. Oh, I see. Oh, okay. Yeah. So it's for 32, right. Yeah. So, but then, how and then, do you... And, and there are four of us, you know, who are in the Silicon Valley Quad, so who bring different perspectives. Oh, diff also, that's mm -hmm. also kind of uh, help you to yeah. see the so bigger it, picture. So, so, so it's all done mathematically. Yeah, and uh, nobody has done it this way before. Yeah, I know, I understand, you know, that makes a lot of sense. But let's say within each particular SES, for example, mm -hmm. how do you pick this SES new venture versus the other one? You know, what's the selection criteria for the... So we have one partner who's very much part of the SES industry. Mm. So, so, so we know where the overarching market is going. In SaaS, and you know, we know what it takes to build a SaaS company. Mm. Yeah, yeah, we yeah. So, so the four partners who are there all bring totally different backgrounds. Mm. So, so we are not going to have group things. Yeah, that's very good, like yeah. complementary yeah. thoughts. Yeah, yeah. and uh, yeah, we all believe in this basic formula. Uh, we cannot give them the valuation which will not give us the forty x. If it wins, yeah, we need to in the 40 years. That's very smart. Yeah. Yeah. And, yeah. and there's no shortage of deal flow. And uh, since we are able to take this ultimate risk, we are traveling into situations where uh, competition is not that tough. Mm. Most angels give you half a million to a million dollars. Mm. We are able to give you two and a half, three million dollars. Oh, okay. Uh, yeah, 31 investors have given us enough pool. Yeah. So, so I, I'm willing to I'm able to give you enough cash for 18 to 24 months. Oh, okay, 18, okay. Yeah, you know, uh, you know, Mr. Entrepreneur, you have enough cash from me from 18 to 24 months to get to a financial. Yeah, as you t I'll talk earlier, like a yeah. financial. Yeah, milestone. Yeah. You are not going to spend any time raising money from anybody else in that time frame. You spend all your time making this thing happen. Mm, mm, mm. You, a lot of entrepreneurs, that half a million million they get drawing and they spend half their time raising money. <laughs> Next round, okay. Yeah, yeah, to yeah, to say, stay in business. I'm going to take care of your financing needs for eighteen to twenty four months. Mm. And, and let's let's uh, between you and me, Edri, you know, what we, that needs to be done to you know, get the VC money. Second part is since we are able to give you three million dollars, we are able to attract the best deals out there. Mm. And we are able to pick and choose. Mm. So there's nobody else doing what we're doing. Mm. Yeah. So our competition is not the VCs because they don't play this game. They don't play the super risky game. And yeah, our competition is this angel investors who are not able to give you more than half a million to million dollars. Mm, I see. Yeah. So th that's a big differentiation. Yeah. Big differentiation for the entrepreneurs. We solve your financing problems for 18 to 24 months and we you free you up to attitude. Yeah. But earlier you said many times in your investment philosophy, you 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 said you cannot predict the technology, the business because it changes all the that's time. That's the reason we have thirty-two of them. Oh, that's right. Okay, but but you said yeah, you, one in four. All I need is one in four to work. But you focus on people. But in this yeah. particular investment, yeah, yeah, do you yeah. select people? Oh, absolutely. Uh, that is always overriding mm. concern. Yeah, the bet is on a person that you think who's likely to be a winner. Mm. And then the secondary barriers and technology and market. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. So, so the four of us who are doing it are entrepreneurs who have done it, who are very successful uh, uh, in building companies, who are very successful rather in you know, you know, doing angel investments alone. So we are hoping that by pooling our uh, ideas and thoughts together, yeah, and yeah, 
the basic theory is that yeah, we hopefully we'll get better deals. Yeah, uh, hopefully yeah, yeah, we'll provide a good mentoring to the entrepreneurs and and we're giving them good financing, and yeah, hopefully yeah, with our name and reputation, we'll help you get the VC financing a little better than than you yeah. on your own. So it's all mathematical. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I now I can see the thoughtful calculation yeah. to diversify the risk or to mitigate the risk. Mitigate the risk on both sides. Yeah. yeah. Thank you for watching.